It will be nice weather. Just, yeah, and time flies. Be. God, yeah. it's just great to have soccer back. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you just fit fitting real in with that Yeah, beard. is it going to be? <laughs> it's gonna rain on Sunday. It is. It is? Yeah. Oh, oh, never mind. See, that's why I'm gonna just stick to sports. <laughs> oh, it's just, yeah, it's gonna be <laughs> great. <laughs> Lovely weather. And then they call me up. They're like, "You said it's gonna be sunny." Yeah, no, I nope, didn't. That was the sports Blame channel. Blame Adam. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So let's watch carefully. Okay. <laughs> Talk about we'll do. Pay attention. Bye, Adam. everyone. I love it. <laughs> Adam. Oh, Adam. Don't cry, Adam. It's gonna be okay. Okay. Uh, so we're gonna talk about that forecast. I like his optimism. It'd be great to have a little more sunshine on the weekend. Uh, but for now, we will talk about our chances for any few sprinkles left over tonight. 43 right now in Ridgefield, and you have alienate off to the left, and then off in the distance, you have Woodland, and then beyond that, Kelso and Longview all up along I-5. And the clouds covering Mount St. Helens right now, so we can't show you that gorgeous view, but on a clear day, it's really nice. Over to Kalama, it is 48 degrees. Pretty colors out on the water. Nice, calm conditions there on the Columbia River. Now, let's talk about tonight. If you're spending any time downtown Portland, we're expecting, for the most part, it should be dry. Uh, any chance for a few isolated drops will be coming through. Most of that happening uh, on the east side of the coast range. So let's say you're heading up and over uh, 26 going uh, along Sunset Highway. You might run into a quick shower there. Otherwise, we're on our way to partly cloudy skies for the rest of the evening. Temperatures in the low 40s and then closer to midnight, we'll have some partial clearing. By then, temperatures are going to be likely in the upper 30s. If we get some better clearing, our temperatures will drop a lot more down into the mid to even lower 30s. And then we'll be left with, yeah, perhaps some fog tomorrow morning. Right now, your temperatures are in the upper 40s from Corvallis through Salem, Portland over to Kelso. At the coast, we're in the mid 40s, Mount Hood, 25. So our next system is going to kind of skirt by us. It's going to say almost oh, hello and not quite. We're going to get the tail end of this, this next system. This is tomorrow, tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening. Uh, most of that is going to be happening for western Washington and the northwest corner of our state. We could see a few sprinkles coming through. Otherwise, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, it's on to some pretty nice weather, warming temperatures under high pressure. And then our next chance for rain arrives. Friday night, just before midnight. That also means more mountain snow for you on Saturday. Take a look at that. Now let's get in a little bit closer and show you what this looks like on a smaller scale. About 8 o'clock tomorrow evening, again, a chance for a few showers to run through the valley really quick and then up and over the mountains. And at this point, not expecting much for snow to really show up. Wednesday, Thursday, looking pretty good for nice outdoor weather. All the way through Friday afternoon until we get to Friday night. There's our next chance to see some rain and yes, some mountain snow. That mountain snow showing up for us Saturday. So midday, you can uh, count on snow falling right over those mountain passes, sticking around all the way through Sunday. Sunday, more wet weather for us here in the valley, but most of that will actually be hanging on to Oregon, not so much Washington this time around, and that'll be through Sunday night. Now let's talk about your temperatures tomorrow at the coast. We'll be in the low to mid 50s, mostly cloudy kind of day for us. Mid 50s also expected in the valley, so a little bit warmer than what we had today. Today's highs were only up to about 48 and 49. Central Oregon getting into the upper 50s. Morning temperatures right around freezing. And then over to the gorge, we're expecting 37 for your morning temperature and Hood River 52 for a high. Government camp up to 46. And there is your seven day forecast. So uh, again, brief chance for uh, an early evening shower tomorrow morning. It's not going to stick around that long. And then we're on our way to a nice warming trend Thursday, Friday, possibly up to 60. All right, but the weekend may be a little rain. Yeah. Feel a rain. All right. Thanks, yeah. Natasha. Let's not talk about it.